Digital content creation often starts with freehand sketches of artists illustrating an object. Building a 3D visualization from these sketches is especially challenging when applied to volumetric materials such as smoke. In this paper, we therefore present a novel method to compute a 3D smoke density field directly from 2D hand-drawn sketches using a convolutionary neural network bridging the gap between early-stage sketch-based prototyping and visual realization. From the sketch inputs representing the front and left views, we compute an initial volume estimate and refine the density iteratively with a convolutional neural network. This architecture reflects and enables the constant interplay between artists and digital content. We then apply a second network to improve the volumetric functions based on synthetic noise-based velocity fields, enabling post-processing control functionalities for artists. During training, our pipeline takes a single density field and generates corresponding sketches on the fly for the end-to-end -end training. At each pass, we pick a random view for training and calculate view-dependent losses. The updater network iteratively refines the reconstructed density. A pass loss is computed on intermediate results to match all target sketches. At the core of our method is a differentiable sketch generator for smoke volumes, which allows us to compute a sketched representation of the reconstructed density and to compare this to the input sketch by using a sketch loss. To increase the robustness with respect to variations in artist style, we augmented the sketches used in the training to cover different values for brightness, contrast, contour strength, tune shading color, blurring and slurring in X and Y direction as noise addition, and variations in light direction in X and Y. Our training dataset captures a wide range of different smoke simulations such that it ensures general applicability of the approach. The shapes of initial sources are generated by computing a random shape from a set of union or difference of 3D primitive shapes, and setting the resulting shape and initial density of a fluid simulation. Our network reconstruction shown on the right is able to closely recover the training data depicted on the left. We tested our method on several synthetic examples that were not part of the training dataset. We show results on physically simulated smoke. We additionally show results on non-physical animation inputs, such as a character animation and procedurally generated clouds. In these examples, the sketches of the target shapes were far from our training dataset. We include hand-drawn sketches of smoke from different artists to validate our model at test time. We instructed the artists to sketch keyframes that resemble real-world smoke as well as imaginary, non-physical smoke shapes. Due to the high computational performance of our method at test time, the model can be integrated into existing authoring frameworks. This video clip shows a live recording of an authoring session. The generated density volume can be used as a target keyframe in fluid control optimization approaches, resulting in animated sequences. We show the results when training without and with sketch loss, indicating that the sketch loss is essential for a high reconstruction quality. Thanks for watching.